Should I stay or should I go? Should I stay or should I go? Okay, so remember when I was gonna, you know, do this off camera and actually get these, the last two stars to go to this guy's place? Well, just gonna let you guys know, I didn't do that. I think that's my main problem is that I always say, like, I'm gonna go off camera and collect, I'm gonna get this stuff, I'm gonna go grind this up, I'm gonna go stargazing, I'm gonna go moonshine and I'm gonna do all this kind of crap, I'm gonna go Pokemon leveling, that one's for Dane, and then I never do it. Because I just think it's boring. No, I'm just kidding. I just like to keep you guys, you know, I, I like to just keep you guys bored the whole time, you know? I want to show you, just want you to see that I'm collecting stars and not really having too much of a progressional thing. You progressives out there. Wait. Oh, hold on. I thought there would be a, a transparent star. Hey, welcome back. Nicola Legend, yeah. Oh, that's what that means. Uh, what about this one? This is another question mark. I don't want the question marks. Here we go. Here's one that just has a space for me. Ooh, this is the one where the penguins got real jacked up. Remember the penguins? Remember when Mario 64 and Sunshine and maybe Mario Galaxy 1? I don't remember. But Mimi, just remember those. Oh, there's a key to my heart. Just remember those games had like five or six stars per world. I thought that was insane, to be honest. I thought that was really crazy. Uh, what? Why? What did you guys do to this guy? What the fuck's your problem? What'd you do to him? <gasps> this little guy's trapped in there, so everyone's out looking for the key. Oh yeah? He just decided to get trapped here. I was here like a second ago. Jeez. Oh, this, is, this is just what I get. This is just what I get. You know, you try to do... Oh, everything's ice still. But he's in a bottle of glass, so what were you guys doing? Whoa. That's some cool stuff right there. Kill some fish. I mean, the Eskimos don't need it, so, you know, everything's all right. Everything's look, everything's going pretty good. Hey, what's up, buddy? Everyone is 13 inside. Well, let me try. The Plema Man, the man of the hour. The man that knows no bounds and can use his butt for anything. Sliding. Hip dropping. Swimming. Swim fast with A. Thank you. Why is it telling me about controls now? Should have told me the first time I was doing this. Oh, we got a little bit of a bubble attack. Oh, I think I think you could spin out of it. You know, I always say like bubbles are always like a, a gamer's like worst fear. You know, sometimes it helps you, sometimes it doesn't. I'll never understand it. Like Sonic the Hedgehog loves bubbles. I mean, I don't know. It's just it's just a weird freaking mechanic. I don't know. Just like how like uh, what was it? Oh yeah, Mario can just breathe underwater forever, like in the old days. But I guess in this one, he actually has air. That wasn't a thing they decided to, decided to change. Grab a coin to get more air. Oh, so now it's coin. Coins that do the air talking. There we go. What's wrong with this guy? Whenever you see a switch, spin it to flip it. Or you never know what will happen. Is that what you're trying to tell me right now? Okay, no. Okay, going back down. All right. So under the sea, more you can be. I like to pee. Where are those lobsters? Where are the r r r r? Ah, so yeah, it's pretty great that they added a breathing thing. Open the door. Just be careful. I just had to do a little spin trick for some reason, just to show off in front of the penguin. He's like, "Whoa, that was cool, Mario. Your name's Mario, right?" Oh, it's that thing. <laughs> Oh god, remember the uh, terrifying eel in Mario 64? And that, uh, what was that, dry dry docks or something? Oh, the battery's running low. Oh, that's what happens. Get clonked on the head. Just a reminder when batteries are running out. I think it was dry dry docks or something like that. That was a, uh, that was a scary level. That was one of the, that was like, notably one of the scariest enemies in that game. And probably all of video game history. Same with the evil piano. That was terrifying in its own regard. And by the way, uh, I'm swimming in space. It's kind of neat because guess what? You kind of do that. Well, you float in space too. And but right now it's. What? What? What's Mario doing? 
he was like, I think he was having some crazy head trauma because he was looking up the whole time. And I guess the game was just trying really hard to, to really bother me on that. You gotta get your shit together, man. Oh, psych! That guy's like, man, I was gonna actually help him out this time. Hello. This keeps going, going. I think you have to dive in there. All right. I remember. I remember. Woohoo! Yay! I'm in a water block. Oh, it's a gelatinous cube. Retreat! Retreat! These are gelatinous cubes. Like exactly. Where are the keys? I mean, they got the star bits in them temporarily, and there's a goddamn black hole that is terrifying. I don't want, like, oh, that's so terrifying. Oh, we gotta spin. You have to spin in order to get out of the water. I guess that makes sense. Doc Kong ain't got that type of trick. He ain't definitely got that type of trick. Oh, look at this money I'm getting. Thank you. Mario's like, I don't, I, I don't know how this happened. I don't know what's going on, but there's been this star cursor in front of my face for a long time. Got you, little guy. It was more human in there than you think. Turn into a star. Whoa! -hee. I gotta. <coughs> oh look, it's Captain Toad's little little thing. Nah, I'm not talking about his penis, okay? <laughs> Definitely not talking about that. Oh, I thought this would be over. Uh, how long are we gonna spin for? Uh, don't know what the problem is. Oh, right. I know how to drill. <laughs> I know how to drill. What? what the fuck just happened? What just happened? What just happened? What, why did I drill and I didn't go the right way? Oh. Trying to find the right patch, eh? Now I see. That's not what I wanted to do. Not even close. Oh, but I got him though. Oh, I thought I killed him. What the hell, game? You're just going to be so mean to me like that? Got to find the right place to drill your wife. There we go. No, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry. They're like, oh man, now I'm never gonna get laid. So, what's the problem here? Why can I not do this? Do I have to drill them? Oh, I guess I do. I guess we gotta kill them all. It's one of those time things. Remember when Doom had these time events? Or, not time events. Remember when games had like these. Well, actually, a lot of games did that, where you kill a certain amount of enemies, and, like, uh, a door appears, or a door unlocks. And it was, like, it was like their clever way in Zelda, or even Doom had that, uh, where, like, you pick up something, and zombies appear, or you kill something, and, and uh, everything's okay. <laughs> oh, there's the key. Who would have thunk it? Who would have thunk it? Um, I just thought that was always kind of interesting to me, um... In other news, uh, Dead Space was probably one of the few that did it right because it's like uh, quarantine uh, detected or something, or threat detected quarantine. So it kind of like, it made sense that it was like crazy and shit, even though you picked up something, I don't know. But then it's like quarantine lifted. Have a good day. <laughs> so I thought that was cool, okay? It's all right. But we got a star. I was a swimmer with the fishes on that one. Yahoo! Look at the star of me. Just best buds for life. Bing. I think I got time for one more if I speed run it. You know how that goes. That took me, like, quite a bit. But I got an extra life, though. Ooh. You have to show me now. <laughs> Assassin Penguin on board a spaceship. That's a new one on me. Yeah, well, let it be. Look, I love all the races. We're all friends. So, if Mario is such a bad guy, how come all these people, like, love talking to me? Oh, great, we got a letter. The chimp. Hey, maybe me. I got a new game over in the Fluffy Buff Galaxy. Come on by and we'll do the whole introduction. I want to see what kind of game skills you got. Sure, buddy. Should I stay or should I go? Should I stay or should I go? Oh, there's a question mark. Stop telling me about that. I don't want to know my secrets. Okay, fine. We'll go back to the floof floof. Time to go to floof floof. All right, where is this? Oh, it's here. Okay, next time on... on I was about to say father and son. I sometimes do that. On the Nikos quest, we'll be in time to beat this level. Then we'll 
do Bowser or something. Maybe I'll just record it starting off when we have to start. Uh, 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 uh,